everybody. Welcome back. These are some people that took Halloween way too seriously. Not me, though. I just got this costume off of Amazon for 50 bucks. <laughs> you look like... <laughs> I look like you. <laughs> Baby shark. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Baby shark. I'm Mama Shark now. <laughs> like, look how, look how crappy it is. It's so bad. <laughs> is there a fin at least? There isn't even a fin. No. Do you have a video with the blue light? I'm obsessed with this costume. Whoa, she's a lava lamp. Whoa. I like how the bubble just like ever so graciously covers you know what I'm saying? How does one walk around? Is this more of just like something we post on social media or are you gonna go out in that thing? <laughs> hey, the chances of you getting COVID in there are pretty low. <laughs> Note to self, think of costume that will prevent you from getting the Rona. For Halloween, we made a floating wine bottle that pours forever. Here's how we did it. You'll need a plastic cup and wine bottle, a small water pump, and some clear plastic tubing. The water pump will go inside the cup, so first we drilled a hole in the side of the cup and cut the wire so we could pass it through. We then attached the water pump to the cup, pulled the cord through, and sealed the hole with hot glue. Ah. We reattached the wires and then decorated the bottle with a label and some paint. The plastic tubing gets a slight bend in it using our heat gun, and finally we turned water into wine with a little bit of food coloring. The wine in the cup is pumped through the tube into the bottle. The <gasps> bottle fills up slightly and pours it back into the cup, hiding the tube entirely. Woo! Check out Wicked Makers on YouTube for more awesome Halloween ideas. Wow. Impressive. Very, very impressive. My two favorite things, Halloween and wine. She's a 10, but makes her family costumes from scratch. Stop it. Whoa. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, that's a flex. That is a flex and a half. Honestly, I don't know why the rest of us bother. <laughs> like, I'm just sitting over here in, in the ugliest shark costume on the planet. <laughs> the things I do for you. <laughs> for the record, these are very warm. They're basically my pajamas. I just sent my boyfriend a picture of me wearing the shark costume and <laughs> yeah, it's cute. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's, oh, wow. Did we make this contraption? Y'all are next level, I swear. Does anyone else feel like sometimes on Halloween, you kind of just want to like take the things in your closet that could pass for a Halloween costume and turn it into a Halloween costume? Or just put some ears on, like wear all black and put some ears on. <laughs> I'm a mouse. <laughs> sometimes they turn out really well. One year, my friends and I dressed up as Charlie's Angels and we didn't have to get anything else. We just had everything everything already in our closets. And it was such a good costume that Cameron Diaz herself reposted us on her story. True story. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. Halloween. Trying to win a pumpkin decorating contest. Idea, man eating pumpkin. Oh. I have to make all the small bits first. Wow. These eyes are made from ping pong balls. There was a lot of trust process here. Whoa! Remember annoying orange. This is him now. <laughs> don't do blocks. I actually don't care if I win. I'm just putting off my accounting. <laughs> Tell me you're procrastinating without you know. telling me. This is so derpy, it makes me laugh every time I look at it. Oh, that's a little too realistic. Oh, wow. That's kind of sick, not gonna lie. <laughs> that's really sick. It's not done. He needs to look like he's been. Wow! Wow! Incredible. 
Incredible. Tell me you have too much time on your hands without telling me. <laughs> I'm just hating because I could never make something that cool. I'm just a big hater. Every year I make my kids Halloween costumes and this year my eight-year-old gave me like a huge challenge. She wanted to be her pet hands. <laughs> I don't make stuff like this usually, so I tried my best. I made like a foam suit and a polymer mask oh. and these little like socks. Oh, had those feet. Of oh, my oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The mask was a little bit heavy, so I added like a baseball cap, which helped a lot. <laughs> so you can also, well, I'll let you see here. you <laughs> weird Look, oh, no. that is incredible. Ah! I'm just oh. making one more costume oh, this year, four, and it's my nephew's Naruto costume, which is pretty simple. Okay, let me guess. Y'all are in Canada, aren't you? You want to know how I know that? Because the costume can go over top of a snowsuit. God bless the parents that made the Halloween costumes not only to be fabulous, but also so that they could fit over a snowsuit. Because God knows by the time Halloween rolls around, it's like dead of winter up here. The frigid north. I feel like this only looks like a shark when I close close it like that. Like you'd have to walk around. <laughs> we are emo shark. Where are you? And I'm so hungry. I cannot sleep. I cannot dream tonight. I need to bite your head off. <laughs> I'm having a little too much fun. <laughs> Glue, water, mix. Cheesecloth, I'm not sure what that is. Mix it, get it drenched. Pop it over some balloons on sticks. Let it dry. Oh, it's a ghost. And we pop it. <gasps> oh, that's good. That is next level. Not the other ones. This one. This one here. That's next level. Well, anybody got some cheesecloth? <laughs> Just the cloth, not the cheese. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, I love this. <laughs> There's no escaping. You must come out to confront it. What? Is it attached to the door? This is terrifying. That's so creative. I love that. I just live in the bathroom now. Yeah, she's not coming out of there. What's that? A cauldron. Oh. Double bubble toil and trouble. Oh. Let's see, throw it in. Oh yeah, oh yeah, another one, yeah, do it. Oh, look at that. Oh yes, how delightfully spooky, my dear. Yes. <laughs> the, the corgi's just like, mom, mom, are you gonna throw me in there? <laughs> yes, yes. I have received so many compliments on this cheap and easy to make Halloween decoration. Oh yes, a you throwing know up you skeleton. Him in your yard, and here is how. Barfing skeleton. Grab a garbage can or if you want to be fancy, a barrel. Drill, drill, drill. Grab a clear tubing three quarters inch inner diameter and zip tie to the spine. Next, oh, that's get a for the submergible fountain, a tank pump. This one is 550 grams hours and drop it into water. I decided against the bucket after. Secure your skeleton to the garbage can with zip ties and feed the tubing wires through the hole. Get oh. some acrylic paint and let it drip dry to the sides. Ladies, get those crickets ready. Oh, I love that. Add a black light and zip tie to the can. Toss some highlighters in the water. Happy Halloween. Mwah. Excellent. Excellent work. This is what most of my Halloweens in the past have looked like, honestly. <laughs> but instead of toxic waste, it's fireball. All you need is foil and electrical tape. And I'm assuming talent, which I have zero of. Okay, I think I could do that. I think I could do that too. 
Okay. So, we cover the whole head in tape. Oh. Oh, is she Maleficent? Oh, let's see it. Yes. Oh, I knew it. Okay. Not everyone can do that. You're being nice. Wow. The talent. Too much talent for one video. <laughs> that actually does look relatively easy. Like, I think that probably the vast majority of us could do that. You first. Okay. Okay, DIY queen, what are you up to? Oh, a jack-o'-lantern lollipop filled with candy. Well, isn't that just gorgeous? Oh, he's got a little bow tie. Good on ya, mate. <laughs> so are you doing that for every child in the neighborhood? <laughs> if you are, kudos to you. But that makes sense because according to her screen name, she is a Louisiana woman. I can just picture all the kids in the neighborhood running to her house. <laughs> Guys, Louisiana woman on TikTok is giving out gigantic pumpkin lollipops filled with candy. <laughs> she's a 10, but she makes her own Halloween costumes. Honey, she's a 12. Oh. Oh. Wow. Okay, no, you're a 17 and a half. Imagine being my boyfriend and coming home like this. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Don't tempt me with the <laughs> idea of group costume because I take Halloween very seriously. <laughs> this is my penis. Funkway is the devil. It is very unforgiving and the smell looks like a heap. This project is very that. Wow. Ah! <laughs> okay. Oh, that's effective. I love that a lot. You guys are so creative. Mm. Me over here. I'm a shark. <laughs> Subscribe.